Yes, sir. YouTube, what's good? Metro Doom, it's lunchtime. I'm on break. Just wanted to sit here and chat it up a little bit. Man, I, I know I briefly, yesterday, made a little short three-minute video talking about, you know, the entity that we're dealing with. <laughs> I don't even want to say their name, but I will because we got to highlight this, some of this stuff. Just to backtrack a little bit. Do you guys remember when quote-unquote Activision, Blizzard, whatever, acquisition, blah, 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 when they were facing the lawsuit because of things that were going on in the workplace, especially in the workplace of that nature, that was highly unacceptable, and they claimed it as, what, frat culture or frat behavior, whatever, guys crawling under desks, trying to look up female counterpart skirts, and, oh, dude, just, just think about that for, in an office setting, like, yeah, it would be, don't get me wrong, not not to be a bad influence, yeah, it would be lit, but in an environment like that where you need maximum productivity, that's probably not the best. I mean, it'd probably be cool to, you know, mingle with your workers, you know, maybe, maybe have a little drink or two, you know, to unwind, relax, take some stress off, you know, from the work, you know, it may not be super strict in there as it would be in other jobs, but you get what I'm saying. But yeah, you had that going on. And then uh, what else happened? Was I? Don't get me wrong. I had to pull up these articles. I don't have time to pull up these articles. Like I said, I'm at work. If you can't tell by the background, I got stuff in the back, oil filters on the shelves. But anyway, I, I'm pretty sure there was a woman, rest in peace, that had committed to it because of that environment that they were working in. And that's just one problem. We're just talking about one specific problem, but this directly correlates with, hmm. You know, why did it come to that? What happened in that office that would cause somebody to actually want to off themselves? Like, holy cow, man. And then, you know, you got, you got that going on. Um, you got all these different new, newer, new age, whatever you want to phrase it, type of developers coding these games, injecting new types of code in to mess with people. I mean, it's just all a shit show, man. All a shit show. But let me let me not wander too far off because, like I said, I'm just on break. Think about it. This is a, per se, mature rated game. Supposed to be. So it's supposed to be geared towards adults. But we all know. Everybody plays played this game who don't have such a strict uh, parental guidance, parent, whatever, in the household that'll let them play mature rated games. The thing is, with these mature rated games, it's supposed to be for adults, but they put stuff in it that's geared towards children, and they know that. So, I don't know, this is that. It's, it's, I'm sorry, it's hard for me to even try to explain things like these because one, I'm unprepared. But um, yeah, if this stuff is geared towards uh, adults, but they put stuff in there that pushes an agenda. We know kids watch anime. We know adults watch anime. But you put some weird things in games that are marketable or a ploy or whatever towards a different audience so they can come up and buy this stuff. But when you're doing that, you're enabling somebody that's not of age to be playing that game. And then the, the type of content that is put into the game, whether it's skins, uh, dances, I don't even know. This is just off the top of the head. You, you know what I'm getting at. You're encouraging kids, blah, 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 because this is what they do. You know they did it on Fortnite. Go grab mom's credit card or ask mom, hey, can I buy this out of the game, blah, blah, blah. It's just something that's not for kids. And to even make it even worse, there could be, this is going a little bit in depth, some symbolism with some of this stuff. I don't know if everybody like peeps game when it comes to actually what's put out in front of us. Not to sound like a weirdo or theorist, but some of this stuff has just some weird back messages, symbolisms, euphemisms, alluding to weird crap or behavior or ideals, politics involved. But when it comes to real life, politics do not need to be in video games. People's belief systems should not be in video games. Like, why are you trying to push your opinion your narrative or a group of collective people's opinion or narratives 
inside of a video game. It doesn't need to be there at all. But anyway, it's just a quick little video, man. I'll catch y'all later. Uh, yeah. Peace. This is a certified hood classic. What is the meaning of this? Bobby! What is the meaning of this? Hey, y'all metro, don't trust you. I'm gonna shoot you.